Good morning, the Form.Life friends. This week, we are still at John. Yes, this wonderful sermon series where we're walking through the gospel account of John, looking for these signs of life and leaning into the discipline of study. And believe it or not, we've got two weeks left. So I just wanna say, way to go. You're doing great. If you're watching this and you're continuing in the journey, I'm just so proud of you. I'm proud of us. So way to go. So here's what you can expect this week and how to plan for it. We want you to spend some time, of course, preparing. And we hope this is starting to become a habit where you're anticipating, hey, I'm gonna wake up in the morning and I'm gonna prepare my heart and mind for what God's going to do. And to do that this week, you're gonna read John chapter nine, verses one through 41, and spend some time marinating in that text. Then you're gonna plan out your week for the formed.life. So Monday, when you wake up and you open up your email or you go to the website, here's what you're gonna find. You're gonna have the opportunity to read about the sign of Jesus as the Good Shepherd. And this Monday, you're gonna watch a video from one of our pastors giving you a little bit of background and a question to reflect upon. And this week, you will see Pastor Ben Beasley of the downtown campus. You should have like a bag of treats. I told you each week has been a treat. You've got like a bag of treats now. So Tuesday, you will read John chapter 10, verses 22 through 42, and also look at how a thoughtful Christian in a different time and place is engaging that scripture. And this week, you're gonna read Athanasius, a pastor and theologian who lived in Egypt in the fourth century. And might I just note, there are a lot of theologians in Egypt, in Africa. Isn't that really cool? Just a sidebar. Okay, Wednesday, this is the day when we focus on memorization and meditation on God's word. And we are getting so close to memorizing this whole chunk of John chapter six, verses 47 through 58. Don't give up. You're doing awesome. This week is John chapter six, verse 57, okay? You've got this, keep pressing. On Thursday, we're gonna see how John is deeply rooted in the Old Testament again. And this week you're gonna read from Ezekiel about God's condemnation of the evil leaders of Israel and his promise to step in and shepherd them well. Compare that to Jesus as the good shepherd, okay? On Friday, it's also important to see how John fits within the broader New Testament as well. And this week, you're gonna read a poem about Jesus' relationship to God and creation from Paul's writings. And then you're gonna compare that to John's account. And then on Saturday, this is that space of silence, that space of reflection. You're gonna reread the passage that we've been reading this week, and then you're gonna take some time in silence, and then you're gonna journal and reflect on that particular experience, okay? Well, you're all set for another week. Excited to learn alongside of you. I hope you join us back for the last week in this particular series. Let's put the formed back in biblically informed. Let's engage the discipline of study together this week.